you remember when you was a kid, way back in the days, well, for some it was way back in the days, your parents used to reminisce about how much fun they had on caravan holidays before you were born. Now, I'm pretty sure it, it wasn't fun just because you weren't there, or they might have been. It's all right. caravan vlogging when people reminisce about the old days they do they look at it with a romantic slant don't they so they used to tell you about how good it was and how they used to get water into the caravan using the, the foot pump you know rather than just turn on the tap you used to have to bring it in manually uh, then when it came to putting up the awning i'm sure they said they used to have rsjs as still supports and it took them about eight hours and five people to erect the awning then of course there was a washing of clothes it was always down at the stream scrubbing using a washboard wasn't it i'm sure that was what they used to say then when it came to cooking what was it they cooked on um a range no no it can't be a range can it that's that's ridiculous but it was somewhat equally as heavy it was a big you remember them big round metal thing with a dome lid and um, three legs that took about 45 minutes to put up and all you'd ever own, all you'd ever cook in it was breakfast. What was it called? Let me think. I'm sure I can remember. I'm sure I can remember. I'm sure. Of course, it's a bit like um, <laughs> it's a, sorry, it's a bit like um, Wizard of Oz. <laughs> um, anyway, I'll do a dream sequence now. Dream sequence. Of course, I was joking about the Kadak, were not I? So, we've had a Kadak for years, and they are flipping heavy. Now, I know there are smaller versions. Um, we're on our second Kadak now. Maybe I've told you before, but the first Kadak, we was using it in the garden, celebrating somebody's birthday, and it all got a bit like a party, you know, so there was drink involved, and I'm not sure exactly what happened, but the Kadak caught fire. I think it was maybe fat from the sausages. Came, and any, anyway, it kind of... The, Flames were flicking down near to the on-off switch of the gas, and I had a gas bottle underneath, and it was all a bit... Well, then I vowed never to buy another Kadak. Of course, fast forward a few years, everyone and their dog has a Kadak. Vloggers are going on about how good they are. And as you know, as you'll know, it kind of gets to you. It's like it's constant. Every time you look at somebody in a caravan, they've got a Kadak. Even though I knew they were relatively rubbish i still went and bought one not only did i buy one i bought the one with all the accessories 200 and something pounds and they're big heavy things now i know they do smaller lighter ones you know modern caravanning to me is all about ease of use and everything being as light as possible you'll know that i use the gas light bottles uh, flow gas light you can see the gas levels through them they're obviously but as their name suggests they're light don't need to muck about with these big heavy Calor bottles, I mean, what are they all about? And try and get one today, you can't get one. Obviously, they're safe fuel. Safe fuel has other, other issues, one really expensive to, to buy. And then you gotta find somewhere to fill them up. Now, I know most people seem to be able to find somewhere to fill up, but I've looked at my local area. And anyway, that's, that's not what this vlog's about. What this vlog's about is things being much lighter these days. Air awnings, we're not using RSJs anymore, like we ever did. But the first awning we had did have metal poles and it wasn't they weren't the they weren't fiberglass, they were metal, so they were heavy and it was a heavy awning and if one of those poles fell down, hit you on the head, you'd know about it. One time I had one hit me on the head and also one hit the caravan and make a dent. Now of course as wisdom follows you shouldn't attempt to put an awning up in the wind. Now of course we use air awnings, they're not particularly light to carry but they're very easy to put up so what's the what's the purpose of this vlog then i keep going on about light stuff so i've bought we have bought something lighter for the caravan to cook on now of course this product you'll have you'll have seen other vloggers 
talk about it and one blogger in particular that I have not been influenced by. You'll know this vlogger. We, we had a little bit of a run in a little while ago through no fault of my own. But I'd just like to say that I have not been influenced by the particular vloggers. Every time we take the cat out, we think, you know what, we're going to take this, we're going to... I suppose it's the taking the awning or taking the canopy kind of argument. You know, can you be bothered to take the full awning? Will you, can you be bothered to take the cat out? Will we really use it? You're going to know what I'm talking about. So here, I'll just show you. I'll just show you what, what we've got. Yes, we have succumbed, my friends, to the teppanyaki. Now, my old friend Ian from um, Love of Car Caravans, he had one of these and he used to go on about how good they were. But unfortunately, he came over to the dark side and got a Kadak. Now, I don't think I influenced him to get a Kadak. Kadak. I hope I didn't because now I'm well now I'm looking at these it'll wanna in his words what are his words that's it teppanyaki now a few good things about teppanyaki I've not used it I, 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 you could call it a griddle that's what I mean I haven't used it yet so you know I'm not going to say go and buy one, although there obviously are affiliate links below. So this is by Von Chef. <laughs> you know, who? Now, there was another one that the, the vlogger who I mentioned were kind of pushing. Now, they're, they're sold out anyway, so that proves they're very good influencers. I don't think Von Chef are going to sell out. These are on Amazon. So the good thing about them is, look at that, they're light. I couldn't do that with a Cadillac. They're fairly small form factor and a Cadillac isn't a barbecue. It, don't tell me it is, because it isn't. So all you're doing is cooking on a hot plate on a Cadillac. It just happens to be gas. Now, of course, all of you hobo caravanners that go um, off grid, you ain't gonna wanna use, you ain't gonna be using one of these. You're gonna still be stuck with your 25 kilogram Cadillac or a fire in the woods or whatever you do. So you basically, you cook on the, obviously cook on the surface. Um, and there's this little tray here that goes in there to catch all your fat from your low fat burgers so that's you know and it just plugs in temperature all of the temperature welcome to qvc quality value caravanning <laughs> qcv quality caravan vlogging i suppose it should be this is quality caravan vlogging anyway we're not a shopping channel i haven't changed into a shopping channel honest this is just me showing you something i bought Sorry, I keep ducking out of shirt. Now this particular one comes with wooden spatulas. I mean, really? Wow, who knew? Von Chef with an S, not a C. Now I wanted these for ages, and with the, for the cat out, they're about 30 quid or so. I don't know, something stupid. I've got these little egg, you know, egg cooker things that you can you put on the, like 10 quid, 10 quid. So we've bought the teppanyaki and these for like, well, just, just a bit more than 40 quid. Bargain, 200 pound for a caddy. I know, I know I'm not comparing like for like, but there's something else we bought at the same time. Um, so we're getting really close to getting our caravan now. So hopefully anyway, I've not heard anything, but I'm still hoping, fingers crossed, it'll be very soon. Something else we bought was an electric frying pan yeah we've gone electric we've got no gas for us anymore you see when people don't have cadaks they say why would you want to use your own gas when you can just cook on electric which is obviously true of however when they do get cadaks you know it's the best thing ever until probably until they come to wash it washing it to start with was relatively easy but as time goes on it becomes you know the things do stick to it and it becomes an absolute nightmare now the, the main thing we do like about the cadet is the paella pan because we just cooked everything in that however it's something like i don't know 50 centimeters wide for two of us it's just too much so they are there you go that's what it was modern caravan is fantastic all these things uh, never say never like i was a cadet man and you know i i used to laugh at these teppanyaki people haha -ha. I, I did no I, I actually didn't used to laugh but i used to think Cadillac. Why aren't you using the Cadillac? Everyone uses Cadillac. Why? Because you use a Cadillac because everyone uses the Cadillac. Nothing wrong with Cadillac. Doesn't suit us at the moment. So there you go. 
that's the end of this this week's shopping channel what did i call it qvc quality qcv quality caravan vlogging there you go i'll have qvc on to me now some sort of copyright problem no doubt as i said affiliate links below for both the kadak and the teppanyaki i don't care what you buy <laughs> ah that's it happy caravanning oh no i can't say things like that can i happy holidays unbelievable <clears throat> uh, thanks for watching see you in the next one